Her name was Olivia. I'm carrying both pairs of shoes, right? Because she wants to look at seashells or something. Then she sees a turtle, like 30 feet out. She says, go get it. But how am I going to do that with this $1,000 suit up, right? Before I know it, she's stripped down to her unmentionables and she jumps in the ocean. <laughs> no way. I swear to God. Now, I can't look like a loser. So I drop the shoes, strip down, and I go in after her. So we're in the water, yeah? Then a wave hits, and my watch gets tangled in her head and falls in. But the water is still just okay to see it, right? Your watch? You know, the one Okada gave me as a gift, huh? I gotta make a choice, you know what I'm saying? I gotta make a choice. Do I save the watch so Okada knows I got it every time I come around? Or do I get the turtle and get this incredible broad? You chose the turtle. I chose the turtle. So I'm diving for it, and I have a couple of unsuccessful swipes, go for it a third time, and then I hold it up, victorious. You know, I put it straight back in because I don't want it to get all green piece on me. Then I'm having the best beach sex of my life. What about the turtle? The turtle? Oh yeah, it swam off. Worth it though. Anyway, what about you, Cassidy? Me? No, the other Cassidy in the car. Come on. What embarrassing story of begotten love have you got? Nah, I got nothing. Lame Dickens is the man with the golden goose. Huh. You wouldn't want to hear that story. Come on, man. We got nothing but time to kill until Okada's house. What? Is this the one that got away? Yeah. Something like that. Honestly? I still remember the first time we met. She was wearing a beautiful cocktail dress. It was this old vintage bar. I was standing alone, waiting. You didn't know why I was there, but it wasn't pleasant. You asked my name, but I lied. I didn't want you to know. Standing at the bar, nursing my drink, I saw you looking at me. I should have looked away, but I didn't. I turned to face you. And I left myself open. You came over. Put your hand on my cheek. And I felt what it was like to be loved again and again. and loving. I thought you'd just throw me around and leave the money on the dresser like everyone else. You made me feel safe. Powerful. Dominant. You threw yourself at my mercy. both exposed, vulnerable, yet safe in each other's arms. Jack. Jack! Go! Jesus! Jack! Pay attention to the road. What happened with the lady? She told me she could never be mine. She belonged to another. What happened to you?
Land Deckers. Hey. What happened? Huh? We're at the house. You mind telling us what we're here for? He killed her. Who? Jack. Jack! She was just a hooker, man. Nothing special. She was to me. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. 